The euro and the pound sterling have almost good stock. This could have been caused by a lack of significant events. There is no news even about the US presidential election. Joe Biden once again said that it's impossible to review the election results. Notably, the counting of votes is still in process. This announcement was made in response to numerous lawsuits issued by representatives of Donald Trump. They have required recounting of votes in almost all states. At the same time, the market stagnation could occur amid expectations of tomorrow's reports, including the US inflation data. Today, some representatives of the European Central Bank, including Christine Lagarde, will provide a speech. It's possible that the regulator may reduce its quantitative easing program amid the development of the coronavirus vaccine that may stop the pandemic and implementation of quarantine measures. This particular program was imposed because of the coronavirus pandemic. However, the likelihood is not strong as producers of the vaccine have published only preliminary results. At the same time, representatives of the ECB may make an announcement that will lead to the euro's appreciation. Anyway, the reduction in the volume of the asset repurchase program could be considered as tightening of the monetary policy. After drop, the euro dollar pair entered the range between 1.1780 and uh, uh, 1840. Amid the recent years low, the pair is likely to have within the range until tomorrow. Later, it may show a sharp acceleration. The main trading strategy is based on a break of either limit of the range. It's recommended to open by deals above 1.1840 with a targeted level of 1.1875. Sell deals could be initiated below 1.1780 with a targeted 1.1760 and 1720. At the same time, the pound dollar pair reached the expected level of 1.33. This may lead to a partial drop in the number of loan deals, thus traders may open deals after break of the mentioned level or after drop from it. In the first case, the price should consolidate above 1.33 on the 4-hour chart. If the price fixes below 1.3250, it's likely to decline on the 4-hour chart. That's all for now. We keep monitoring the financial market situation. Subscribe to our channel and see you in several hours. We will take a close look at the US trading section.